What is going on YouTube? Jaden here. I just got done filming a Jeep Gladiator video. So if you want to go check that video out, go ahead. Feel free. I'm not forcing you to, but I am. I'm just waiting for you to subscribe real quick. Are you subscribed yet? Okay, good. Let's talk about the McLaren. I always get this mixed up, but the McLaren 765LT. Um, they're making, I believe, yeah, not I believe. They're making 765 of the cars, um, and LT stands for long tail. Um, so we're going to get into it. So this is the 2021 version of it. I don't think it's coming out in 2020. Um, I look to be buying one of these in the near future. Um, not near future, but first we'll get in the 720S just to start off because the 765 is a the big brother of the 720S. Um, so yeah, let's start with like the engine and stuff. And like, no, how about the layout? It is a mid-engine, so that means the engine is close to the middle of the car. Mid-engine rear-wheel drive, so only the rear wheels get power to like and spin to push the car. And it is a two-door coupe, so it only has two doors. I think dihedral doors that go up or butterfly doors. Di I don't know. Dihedral or di butterfly doors. I'm not entirely sure. Engine has a four-point. Um, yeah, it's a four-liter, four-liter. 4 liter, 755 horsepower V8. And I know you may be thinking, Jaden, why only 755? I think that's only on the US spec ones. I believe like, wherever, McLaren. I think McLaren is built in Britain. The UK um, is actually 755, but I'm not entirely sure, but I think it's that reason that it's only, I'm trying to catch my breath here, okay? That is only, 755 horsepower in America. I'm not sure on that one. I'm just going off what Google told me. Okay. Torque. 590 pound feet of torque. Uh, I'm reading off this computer. Google is doing the justice right now. Transmission. Have a 7 speed twin twin clutch automatic. So, I guess when the car doesn't think you can shift fast enough so you don't get a manual. Because the car is really fast. Which we're about to get to that now. And let's get, this video is going to be relatively short because it's a brand new car. We don't have that many facts about it. Um, so I'm just rambling on trying to get the video as long as possible. This isn't going to be a short video. I can't do nothing about that. Um, I could just wait and sit and make you sit here and watch me, uh, listen to me talk about this. Me rambling on my thoughts about the car, what I'm going to do to it. No. I'm just give you straight facts. You can get the heck out of here and go watch some Top Gear and some Chris Fix, and some Stragman, some Burlacker, and some F-Spot, Los Angeles, Vo whoa, see that? So, my hand is on the screen, guys. That's not editing, it's just the light. It's like a really cool. I don't think you can guys can see it, but I can see it. You can go go watch some F-Spot, all those other car YouTubers, like, who else? Savage Garage, um, Tavares, Tyler Hoovies, um, Vin Wiki, all those other car YouTubers. Um, what was that? Curbway. Curbway. Arms around 2,200 pounds dry. Dry is with no water on. And that's around 3,000 pounds wet. Top speed, like I said. Um, I said, I don't know what I said. Um, top speed is 205 miles per hour. I don't know how because if you look at a picture of, like I'm showing on the screen right now, a pic the picture of this 720S, as you can see, there's this arrow on it, but it's not visible. But if you take a look at this um, 765, there's a lot of arrow. And I believe, what's the top speed on the 720S? Well, I do a quick little Google search. Top speed. Oh. Oh. I stand corrected. I freaking stand corrected, guys. The McLaren 720 is faster. Which is good. Well, for you guys. Not 
not for me. Because I'm getting, I, I really want the 765. Um, top speed, 212 miles per hour on a 720S, just a 720S. And on the 765, it is um, 205 miles per hour. So I believe that's a lot down. I'm not totally sure. I don't do math that quick. And it's 0 to 60. So in my last video, I did not do 0 to 60 times for the Jeep Gladiator because who's drag, drag, who's, who's taking the Jeep Gladiator on a drag strip? The next car I'm doing, you're definitely taking on drag strip. So stay. It's built for it. Dodge built that car for drag. But 0 to 60 times is 2.7 seconds. So this video almost freaking six minutes long. I didn't think it would go this long, guys. So I'm just going to end up closing out the video here because there's nothing else to talk about now. Excuse me. There's nothing else to talk about now. So I'm just going to cut it off. Edit these videos real quick, post them, and do some stuff around the house. And I don't know what to do next, guys. Oh my gosh. I guess do some more Carfax for the next couple videos. If you guys want to see that, make sure you subscribe. Because you should have did that at the beginning of the video. If you don't subscribe, you're not getting a cookie. And that's just, that's just saying if you made it this far in the video. So...